The term montage is derived from French, which means putting together or editing. In movies or videos, montage refers to a special and artistic editing technique. It lets us tell the full story without the limitations of space or time. Furthermore, in some cases, a montage can be a useful way to convey emotions and thoughts. Primarily, montage can be classified into two types: narrative montage and expressive montage. Meanwhile, we can separate these two major types of montage into different categories according to certain functions. And today, we are gonna talk about one of the narrative montage techniques: time manipulation. This kind of montage can give a bunch of information to audience in just a few shots, and this can help audience understand the time sequence of the storytelling quickly. For example, Pete Dodder, the director of Up, told the whole story of Ali being with Carlo in less than four minutes. In addition, he clearly described how Ali and Carlo got together and what are their personalities in just seven shots. Let's watch a clip. You know, you don't talk very much. I like you. Wow. We can find it. it describes the different personalities of Ellie and Carl. Meanwhile, we can feel they two are attracted to each other. Keep watching. The scene changes from the popping of balloons to the flashlights of the cameras. Herein, the director uses the techniques of expressive montage and a sound match to show the passage of time, as well as take the audience to the next narration naturally. The director uses four shots to show the wedding scenes. Meanwhile, he uses a comparative shots to show the difference in the personalities of Ellie and Carlos families. That's the magic of montage. Actually, this montage technique can also be used in routine daily editing. We can see the uses of time manipulation in many travel vlogs. In order to achieve this, a complete sequence should be in our head before we start editing. For example, I want to use this technique in my video to show the boys grow up. First, I prepare four clips which look like this. Each can show a different stage of this boy. Then we download the video prac flagger for free. Open it up. Start a new project. Drag the prepared footage onto the software. Then, according to the time sequence, we drag these four clips to video track by turn. Then let's use the mouse to drag the ends of each clip for changing the durations. Preview the work. We can feel the boy's growth in these four simple shots. Let's improve the connections between different shots. Find the transitions icon on the left top. Click on it. There we have many presets to choose from. I chose the ripple and drag it to here. Change its duration. In the same way, we can add a ripple transition in between these two clips. Adjust the duration for this effect. Now let's play the outcome. The transitions do not just make the switches between different clips more smooth, but also make the passage of time feel more obvious. 
As for the connection of the last two shots, I want to make use of the blue color which can be found on both shots to make an invisible cut. So the transition here looks different than the previous ones. Click on this clip. Find the motion icon on the toolbar to enter the motion editor panel. Click on add to add a zoom in effect. Drag the first keyframe afterward to make the zoom in effect starts from this place. Then we adjust the parameters for the second keyframe to make the blue color takes over the entire picture after zooming in. Let's preview what we get. Then we hit apply to come over to the main interface and select the fourth clip. Hit the motion icon to add a zoom out effect Adjust the parameters for the first keyframe to make the zoom out effect start with the entire picture shows a blue color. Then drag the second keyframe forward to speed up the zoom out process. Take a look at what we get. Hit apply to add the adjustments. Now let's check out our final work after we use the time manipulation technique. All right, that's all for today's tutorial. We'll bring you more knowledge and applications of montage in the next video. Don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe if you haven't yet. See you in our next tips. Hope you enjoy. Bye.